Mary, and we are live from the Fife Business Center. I'm so excited to be here today because Mary's going to explain the difference between a Costco warehouse and a Costco Business Center. So thank you so much for joining us today. My pleasure. Yeah, so how long have you worked for Costco, Mary? Uh, July will be 15 years. Last week. Well, congratulations. Thank you. I love it. Yeah, and how long have you worked for the Business Center? I have only worked for the Business Center. I started at the Linwood Business Center, and now I work at the Central Office. And my next question is, what is what is the favorite part of your job? You know, my favorite part is really working with the business members because there's a there's a real disconnect with the uh, Costco members understanding the difference between a business center and a traditional building. And I love working with the businesses to show them the items that we carry and how we can save them money. Now talk about the difference between a Costco and a business center. I, I would love to. So. A traditional building, which most people shop at for their everyday supplies, uh, the difference is the business center, over 70% of the items at the business center you will not find at any other Costco. And this is an example here. This is the entrance of the business center. As you can see, we're in the commercial appliance area, where at a traditional building, we would be standing among TVs and jewelry right now. Um, the other difference is we deliver. So if you are in a commercially zoned, your business is in a commercially zoned area, we do next business day delivery to your area out of the, the 18 business centers that are in the U.S. and Canada. Um, that, that's the main difference. The other difference is, as you know, most of you are familiar with this, this is the coupon savings booklet that the traditional buildings do. Well, we don't carry a lot of these items, so this booklet, these coupons are not valid at the business center. Instead, we do our own, we call them business savings events. So we do our own coupon savings event, and this uh, we do seven a year, and they're for five weeks. And so those, those are the main things that are just, uh, the biggest differences. Uh, another difference uh, with the business center is if you're a volume, if your type of business is a volume customer, where you're a bakery, or you're a wholesaler, or a vending company, then we do have bulk opportunities, truckload, uh, volume shopping opportunities. Even if it's an item that we don't carry, we, we uh, if it's that, if they're buying in volume, we can get that item. Now some of those items uh, you mentioned, what would those be? Uh, sugar, mm -hmm. uh, flour, you know, a lot of times we might only carry certain uh, skews of flour, but they, uh, a, a really good one is shepherd's, shepherd's grain flour. We do carry that now, but at one point we didn't, and we were able to bring that in in truckload quantities for a local bakery. Now, when did the first business center start? Um, so, the first business center started in 1985 in Linwood, Washington. And it was a traditional Costco, and then we opened, uh, it really outgrew its space. And so we opened another one seven miles south, and we had this empty building sitting there, so we decided to open it as a business center. And over the years, just working with the industry, working with the businesses that shop with us, we've evolved to where we are today, to where we really focus on the food service industry, convenience stores, and professional office. However, any Costco member can shop at, at the business center, and we do carry a lot of items that every you would buy for your everyday home. Now, how many business centers do we have? Uh, there are 18 in the U.S. and Canada. Okay. Can you name them all for us? Yes. And I'm going to count for you. So, so okay, I'm you count. You. Okay. So I'm going to start on the West Coast. Okay. Uh, I'm going to flip this just in case I get stuck. Okay. So I'm going to start on the West Coast. We have seven business centers in California. In the Bay Area, we have one on Hayward on the uh, West East Bay. And then on the West Bay, we have one in South San Francisco. There's four business centers in L.A. Um, that cover the L.A. area. Uh, Commerce, Burbank, Hay Hawthorne, and uh, Westminster. And then we have a business center in San Diego. So, so that's California. There, okay. So in Washington State, which is where we're at, we have two. There's one in Linwood, Washington, and one in Fife. Uh, we have one in Las Vegas, one in Arizona, one in Denver, uh, one in Chicago area. Uh, we have one in Atlanta, one in Orlando, Florida, and one in uh, Hackensack, New Jersey. And that's 16. So that's 16. Okay. There's also a business center. It's a hybrid building. It's a business center and a regular Costco in uh, Salt Lake City, and we just opened our first business center in Toronto, Canada um, last year. And so, um, are there any additional services that we offer at the business center versus the warehouse? So, all the services that you would find uh, are available. Uh, the only other additional services that we offer here is that the main one is that we deliver. 
because you know not every business uh, wants, can, can make it in to pick up their merchandise. And so that's the biggest service that we offer is that we do next business day delivery. And I know you talked a little bit about earlier about the layout of the warehouse. So talk kind of walk me through when you come into the building, you're not seeing the TVs, you're seeing commercial appliances. Right. Right, so when you walk into a regular Costco, you're going to find televisions, computers, jewelry, clothing. When you walk into a business center, you're going to find commercial appliances and commercial equipment. And then as you walk down, you're going to see in the candy aisle uh, just an expanded selection. For example, just in Trident gum alone, we carry 13 different varieties of Trident gum that we sell. This is a really good example here. This is a variety pack of five gum. It's peppermint, spearmint, winter mint. This is what you would find. I purchased this from one of the traditional buildings, but this is what we sell here. So we sell all these flavors, but our business members don't. They, you know, they want to. They want the straight pack because they want to buy whatever they need to resell. But this is, you know, this you could buy this at the traditional building. This is what you would find at the business center. And so that's the main thing. Is and that's why 70% of the merchandise is different because we're, we want to cater to the business needs and only 30% is the crossover of what you would find at your traditional buildings. Wonderful. And you said it earlier, but all our Costco members can shop at the business center. Yes. And then we do have a little bit different hours here. Talk about the hours. Yes. So the business centers open at 7 a.m. Monday through Friday, we're open 7 a.m. until 6 p.m. And Saturday, we open 7 a.m. till 4 p.m. And we're closed on Sunday. So don't come on Sunday, come the other day. Yes. Yes. And the main reason is because business members are you know, getting ready to open their business. So they need to come in, get their merchandise, and get out so that they can go open their businesses. So talk about exciting items that we have here at the business center. So, it, you know, like I said, we don't carry anything like jewelry, clothing, but some of the really exciting stuff uh, is in the, if you go to the chip aisle, uh, you know, we don't carry a lot of the big bags, but we do carry a lot of the smaller bags that you would want to buy. You know, a restaurant could buy that to, to put if it's a deli, if it's a vending machine company, or a lot of people buy that for their home because they'll put them in their kids' lunches. Yeah, well, great. I'm glad you said that because I had an opportunity to do a little shopping before the live started and got some of my favorite things. So I just wanted to show, first of all, the Cheez-Its, which are amazing because my kids love Cheez-Its. And you can get them in little um, snack packs for the lunches. I still have two kids at home. Also, Skinny Pop. I think selfishly, that's for me. Popcorn is one of my favorite things. And then also LaCroix. I mm -hmm. found this. Now, I got the variety pack, but I noticed that. And I tried to text my son to find out his favorite flavor so I could get all the things. But there was like five or six different flavors uh, specifically. So instead of getting the variety pack, you can just get all of yes. that. And I know we're going to take a little tour after yes. this. And you're going to kind of show how many different varieties that we have. Yeah, and that's a good example because, uh, you know, if you think about it, if you're a convenience store, you don't want to keep having to buy the variety pack because you may have, uh, you know, you want to come and buy what you're out of so that you can just replenish your stock. But we do carry the variety pack because any member can shop here and a lot of people do come and shop here for uh, items that they would purchase for home or if they're a caterer. Uh, you know, a good example, my daughter got married a year and a half ago lot of the uh, items for her wedding, the, the, the plates, the, the, the cutlery, the napkins, um, we bought here at the business center. Yeah, and the small item too, so everything's not so giant, right? Yeah. So this is kind of a 16 pound and other great thing for my kids' lunches. So. Perfect. Excited to take those home with me. So can we purchase a lot of these items online? You can. Uh, everything you see in the business center, there's some limitations if it's a, a really heavy item. It's not available for delivery, but you can purchase these items if you're business in a commercially zoned area and have those delivered. Uh, the best thing to do, you can go to CostcoBusinessDelivery.com. You can also go to Costco.com and click on Business Delivery on the top header and get to the Business uh, Delivery website because it is a different website, and then you can see all the items that are available for purchase. Now, the, the delivered price is slightly higher than the walk-in price, but it's all built in the uh, into the delivered price of all buildings in their online. So tell me some of the top selling items that we have at the business center. Um, you know, water is a, is a big one. It, it really depends on the type of business that you're working, that, that, that you're, that's ordering, because we do a lot of meat and produce from here. Uh, we do a lot of flour, a lot of sugar. Sugar is a really big item. We do a lot of truckloads of sugar uh, throughout the U.S. Um, 
Uh, energy drinks is a big item here because we deal with a lot of convenience stores. Uh, it, it just really depends. The other good example too is um, when you look at the uh, deli meat, you know, at the regular Costco, you're going to find it already sliced, and here we sell it in the, in the chubs because the, the restaurants or the delis want to come buy it and slice it themselves. Well, we're going to take an opportunity to answer some of our Facebook fan questions. Okay. Thanks again for writing um, on our post because we'd love to answer your questions. First question is, Jesse wanted to know how much is your delivery? So the, the price you see online on CostcoBusinessDelivery.com, the price you see online is the price you pay. It is slightly higher if you were to come and walk in. Uh, but the price you see online is the price you pay. So Patty wanted to know, are there any moving supplies at the business center? We do carry some. We carry bubble wrap. We carry uh, labels. We don't carry moving boxes if that's what you're looking for, Patty. But we do carry some uh, moving moving supplies. Uh, Patrick said, when is the Costco Business Center in Minneapolis opening? So talk a little bit about that. That's so, our next business center. Opening. Yes. So thank you for asking. We are opening a business center in Minneapolis. We're scheduled right now to open late spring, early summer. Uh, we don't have a firm date yet, but uh, Patrick, when we do get ready to open, keep an eye out. We will uh, make sure that everybody in the community knows when that was open. It's under construction right now. Okay, so Tim had a question about granola bars. He said, do Costco Business Center carry the chocolate-covered granola bars? We do carry quite a, 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 a real, really wide selection of granola bars. I don't know it, exactly which item you're looking for, but I can show you all the ones that we do carry. And I always love to give a call out to the business center. Uh, Dode says, I love the business center. Great finds are plenty. Yeah. So, thank you so much, Dode, for your positive comments. We really appreciate that. So we're going to take a tour with Mary. She's going to kind of walk you through and show you the differences at the business center. And then we will also be back live on Friday with Microsoft, we're going to be talking about Xbox products. So Perfect. we'll be back that doing that, but we're going to go with Mary right now and get a tour. Okay, you ready? All right. So, as you can see, when you walk into a business center, this is what you're going to see. It's restaurant equipment and supplies. You know, we don't have, it's, it, it looks a lot different than a traditional building. You know, and you can, it's anywhere from the, the large merchandisers to, uh, you know, the smaller equipment, the mixers. So it's a really wide selection. So anywhere from, uh, we've sold these to schools, convenience stores, you know, any business that would use this merchandise. And then what, now we're getting more into restaurant supplies, so it's going to get into the smaller, the, the, the serving spoons, a lot of the sheet pans. And then as you can see, when you look at the business center, it's laid out totally different. So this is normally where you find clothing. So now you're looking at an expanded selection of candy and gum and mint. So you can see it's a, it's a lot different. The items that we do carry, we carry fewer items, but the items that we do carry, we have a wider selection. And I'll show you a really good example right here, because if you look at just the Reese's alone, you're going to normally see just the Reese's peanut butter cup, but here we have several different varieties of Reese's. And then over here, we do carry a, a supply of office supplies here at the business center. So we do carry some that you could come in and pick up. But we carry over 3,000 more office supplies online that you can order from the website and get delivered. So, as you see, here's the bubble wrap. I'm going to talk about for the moving supplies. Sorry. I... And then, now here's my example of showing you just on the Reese's. You can see all the different varieties that we carry. And that, that, goes, that depth goes within Snickers, M&M's, now we're getting into the meat snacks. So now you're looking at beef jerky and pepperoni sticks. And so it's anywhere from the two pack to now you have the smaller ones that you would sell in a vending machine or you would put those at a deli. So the, the depth goes for, for these products goes really deep. Same with nuts. And then now, as you can see, Here's the gum. So just in Trident gum alone, there's over 13 different varieties. 
that you could buy. So this whole aisle is nothing but gum and mints. And then if you look over here, this whole aisle here is nothing but to-go containers. So anything from the three compartment to-go containers to pizza boxes to compostable to smaller ones, the bigger ones, even the sheet pans that you would use in your steam tables. So you can see the, the depth that we carry here at the business center and how it really caters to the business needs. However, it doesn't mean that just businesses could shop here. And I'll give you a good example. Sorry, if you go right here. So we're looking, what we're looking at here is the forks and you can buy one of these forks, spoons, knives. This is what you'll find at every Costco. But you look at the business center, so you could buy, maybe you only need spoons. We sell them here in a box of 1,000 in black or white. You could buy just the spoons, the forks, the knives. It's heavyweight, medium weight. So, or maybe your type of business, you need the knife, fork, spoon, salt, pepper, and napkin all pre-wrapped. We sell that as well. Or here's a really good example. These are already rolled in the napkin. It's the knife, and the knife fork, spoon. This is what I use for my daughter's wedding. So if you're catering a party or if you're doing you know, uh, if you have a business, you, you have everything to meet the needs. So if we keep continuing down here, now if you look over here, we're looking at chips. And so this is what I was talking about with the chips. You know, we, won't, we don't really carry a lot of the big bags. It's the smaller boxes, uh, or it's boxes with the smaller bags inside. So you could sell them in a vending machine or at your deli, or you could buy them for your kids' lunches. And then as you keep coming back, now you're getting into more of Here's more chips. So as you can see, we don't, the packaging is not always um, very, really uh, pretty because the members that are buying this are gonna resell it. So they really don't care that it's in a brown box, which works perfect for us. So now we're getting into the drink section. And so now you're getting into more of the drinks. And you can see this whole section goes all the way to the back of the building. And so it's more straight packs, of the of the different type of drinks because we're looking at frappuccino here we're looking at some tea we do carry some janitorial supplies uh brooms mops the cleaning supplies so we do carry some here we're getting into more and this is a really good this is one of my favorite examples so you can buy you know dawn you can buy this at any costco and we sell it in a five gallon bucket so it just gives a really good example of the depth that we have to go into to meet our, our business members' needs. So, come with me. We're gonna cut down this aisle. Sorry, I missed one. So, I'm gonna cut down here because I wanna show you the Red Bull. Because the Red Bull, this is what you'll find in a traditional building, is uh, regular and sugar-free, but as you can see, we carry different sizes. So this is a, these are the 24 ounce sugar-free. Um, so you can get, an idea and now you're looking at monster <clears throat> you know you're looking at the depth of uh, the straight cups that you would carry. Okay so if we come down here we're you know right now we're looking at all Rockstar and so you can see Rockstar, Sobe, we do truckload delivery so keep that in mind if your business is one that would buy in large quantities and volume, please reach out to us um, because we do have, so here's the LaCroix that uh, Jody was showing us. So this is a variety pack that you could buy at uh, most Costco's and then as you can see we carry also straight packs. Okay, so now we're getting into the cooler deli area and I, I have somebody that I want to introduced to everybody because uh, I really want to emphasize the different products that we carry in meat and produce that would meet the business members needs so guys I want to introduce you to Joe Joe is the meat and produce buyer uh, for the business centers so Joe can you tell us just give us an idea of what kind of different produce and meat they're going to find here that you would find at a regular building so we still have everything you find at your regular Costco um, we also have case lettuces case tomatoes 50 pound bags of onions and potatoes that you see behind me. Um, we also have some of the further process items, shredded lettuce, uh, cut onions. Um, we have spent anything you possibly need for your restaurant. Um, on the meat side, we of course have prime and choice that you find every day. 
We also have select items, full range of select items on the beef side. We have a lot of unique pork items you wouldn't see in a regular Costco. Uh, some bone-in pork butts, uh, pork brisket bone, which is a really popular item for us. Um, we have 40-pound chicken, boneless skinless breasts, thighs. Um, and we also have some portion cut steaks that we just started bringing in that are very popular. So we have quite a few items. Great. Thank you. So as you can see, here's another really good example that I'll end you with is the Perrier. You can buy the variety, but this whole aisle, if you scan down, this whole aisle is half of it is Perrier. So it shows you just the, the, the varieties of products that we carry. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tour. I know that we're, we're going to be doing more of these tours, showing you more about the business center. Um, if you are a business owner in, and want to find out more about business delivery or shop at a business center, please go to costcobusinessdelivery.com. You can see all the locations or reach out to us or you can uh, comment on here and I will, I will get that message. Yeah, so, so we're going to go so back. Thank you so much for joining us today, Mary. It was great. So thank you so much and we hope to see you on Friday at 2 o'clock.